Welcome back guys to another Battlefield 2042 news video. I'm your boy Sal and we're going over the new released fucking Battlefield 2042 season 5 trailer. They just released it this morning. And do I gotta say, like, honestly, with all the bullshit that Battlefield 2042 has been going through, you, you gotta admit, the marketing team with their trailers has never disappointed. Now, with the trailer now out, we do know the uh, confirmed name of the map. It's gonna be called Reclaimed. And after looking at the trailer, it basically looks like Zavod, uh, Zavod uh, 311. Literally, like, it's a copy. It has to be, like, a copy of it. Like, it's very similar to Zavod from uh, Battlefield 4, if you guys ever played that. We got three new weapons that they um, confirmed. It's going to be the bolt-action sniper rifle. It kind of just looks like the XMR and the... Whatever that one bolt-action bullpup sniper is. We got a new sniper. Uh, the G36C... But in this game, they're calling it the Jew 46. I, I know it's not Jew, but you know, that's just funny. And then we're also getting the Desert Eagle. Engineers are getting a new rocket launcher, the RPG-7. I don't understand why this wasn't put in the original game. Like, it's like 20 years from now, and like, I'm pretty sure most countries will still be using the RPG. I don't know why that wasn't added. The small wasn't added either. Uh, depending on the- we don't know if like, it's different damage, if it's gonna be on the battle pass, or you automatically unlock it as it's a launcher. So, we'll have to see how much damage if it does, like, because it's a dump fire rocket, maybe it's going to do more damage than the uh, recoilless, but at the expense of it can't lock on, etc, etc. One of the most interesting things that we did see is they're adding three new grenades with the Irish nerf coming up, too. We, they were like, oh, let's get three more fucking grenades. Isn't that insane? So, the three new grenades, we got the anti-tank grenade, which you see in the trailer with, um, Casper, or, sorry, Crawford throwing the grenade at a helicopter and one-shotting it. Now, I don't know if it's just for special effects because it's a trailer, but if the grenade can easily one-shot a uh, helicopter, it's really going to be bad for those uh, helicopter boys that just spend their life on the helicopter. But, hey, I mean, hell, fuck them. Uh, we also got the mini grenade is back from Battlefield 4. We know what the mini grenade is. You can throw it a lot farther, probably do a lot less damage. I don't really see the point about that because the regular frag grenade is already a nuke. And you can throw it pretty fucking far. I've, getting, I've gotten killed by those console player Olympian throwers. And then what's new is the spring grenade. I don't know what it's going to be doing. Like what its actual specialization is. But with the spring grenade, it says in the description, clear out infantry of the new spring grenade. I don't know if it's a more shrapnel style thing or if it's like a deployable mine grenade, I guess. You throw it and then like it springs up like a bouncing Betty. We'll just have to see. If we go back to the guns, I'm going to assume the Desert Eagle is probably going to be on the line of the same as the revolver. You could probably one shot, uh, headshot some dudes. Uh, you see in the trailer, the guy one shots fucking through the fucking Nightbird, bro. They are giving helicopter riders a fucking, like, they're just making them look like bitches bro it is so fucking funny i thought that part of the uh, trailer was hilarious we got the new uh, hourglass rework too just a little they got like a few seconds of like gameplay but it's really not much to like form an opinion if we know all the other reworks uh you can kind of see that they kind of looks like they moved one of the points um, to the underground underpass thing. I really don't remember the point because the map is so forgettable. But it looks like they added a whole bunch of more cover. You know, as is a Battlefield 2042 map where you work, we got more cover, more cover, and more cover. We'll just have to see with um, what they're adding. Hopefully, they got rid of all the skyscrapers so we don't get fucking killed by sniping Casper console players. That's not going to be fun anymore. But we'll just have to see. There's, there's no telling. I'm sure all the EA playtesters are going to be posting their gameplay about that. But yeah, that's basically it. Um, exciting trailer, I guess. We'll just have to see. June 7th is the release date for the new uh, for the new season and the new map. That's going to be fun. We'll just have to see how the game uh, feels once the once all the content is out. Because you really can't just form an opinion just by looking at a, at a trailer. Yeah, so that's basically it. Like, comment, subscribe, dislike if you didn't like it. Uh